I, this is Miss D at these special things. All right, you guys, I also got in on the Little Darlings rubber stamps. Um, I don't like these all that much, but I wanted these two because they had the big eyes. This one, mm, not so much. Now, these come on the unmounted rubber. But what I did was I mounted them because I like using them with my Misty and it's easier if you have the cling on there. So what I did was I took mine and I mounted them. But yeah, I'm going to show you the ones that I got. And really I just wanted the saturated, the saturated canary ones because I never collected these. And I thought they were so cute, Backyard General. And I mounted all of mine. It takes a little time. This is Tawny. These are just as cute. I don't know why they're a dollar, but thank you very much. Cherry on top. And like I said, I mounted all of mine. And when you mount them, you really have to get close. Um, I have quite a few other stamps that I purchased, like from rubber necker stamps. I don't know if you all know that one, but I'm, I was happy to get these for one dollar piece. Now, little um, Darling's rubber stamp. Go over there, check her out. She may have some left, but I know I actually got them and, and the delivery was really fast. This is There's Always Tomorrow. Aren't these just as cute? I think I'm going to, I'm going to show you what I'm going to do with mine. And first I have to actually copy some for someone because they didn't get them. And uh, look at that Violet Vintage. I'm going to show you how I'm going to send them to her. I have to see if it works first. Harley and Haley. Um, all of the saturated canaries, I love them. <clears throat> And I mounted all of mine. Yes, so. And then, let's see. This is another one. Elfie. Aren't they cute? Yes, they are. I should have gotten extras. But when I ordered them, I was merely thinking of D. Is it? I mean, that's the truth, you guys. And then, I told, I showed one of my co-workers. And she ordered some, so. I actually stamped these and I stamped them before um, before I mounted them and then I decided you know what it would be so much easier to mount these things but I was able to use them without mounting them but I'm going to mount all the rest of them and I have a little piece here that came with this set and it's the little hearts okay I am going to show you how I mounted them. I did these because I love ballerinas. I love the slippers. She's okay too. She's cute. But just hanging out. Hmm. I'll have to see about her. I haven't stamped her up, but I'll have to see how I like her. And uh, yeah, see what she looks like in the car. But I don't know if you all remember before the red stamps. They used to be they used to be called Stampers Best. And you can actually you could at the time actually purchase stamps for from them for a little or nothing. And they also had the unmounted stamps. And you actually could purchase a package and it came in a box like this. And they had about five of these sheets. I think I have another one, but I have so many stamps that I need to mount. Yes, yeah, so they came in a, uh, a box like this with about five of these sheets in the box. Now, all of those stamps, it took me maybe one and the rest of this. These are nine by two stamps. So I'm going to show you with this little heart how I mount my stamps. Okay, this is the sticky side. And it's easy to show you. I just got to make sure I'm in frame. And... I'll make sure it covers that piece there. Okay. Super easy after you cut them down and you want to cut them so that 
they are and on the sticky side I just take I don't know if this is like they say a correct way to do it but this is how I do mine and then I just actually cut and that's all you do you merely cut around it you got to cut close enough to it so that you're not leaving a lot of the excess on there and I use this pair of scissors all the time for my sticky stuff so that way it's the only pair of scissors that I'm using for my sticky stuff they're they're teeny they're pointed but can you see and this part right here is the cling part this is the part that clings to your your misty and I only have the misty I didn't I had the misty I paid 60 something dollars for that misty so yes uh, I didn't purchase another one because I'm gonna get the best use out of that okay so that is actually how you mount your rubber steps okay all right you guys I am actually that's it for my um for that video but yes I just wanted you all to see the oh let me show you how I'm going to actually copy these from a girlfriend these books cost me 75 cent maybe at they're not books it's paper at Joann's in their $1.99 cent bin these were on sale for um a dollar nineteen because everything was forty percent off and then I was able to use my twenty five percent additional off of the total so I purchased a bunch of these because the day before I purchased them and they were actually they cost me seven something cents. So I went back to the store. The paper is pretty thick. Yes, and it's just the white craft paper. So I think I ended up buying something like ten of these because the paper was pretty good. I'm going to stamp all those images in this book. I have to see if I'm able to do it with my Misty. I should be able to, and I could, I could actually um, put a few on each page, and I'm going to send this to. My girlfriend I might what I might do is tear it in half because it shouldn't take but 20 of the sheets and decorate the front and send one to one person and maybe you guys if I could get through it I hate promising you guys stuff because who you guys I am really and I think I like it when I promise people stuff and I have to rush to get it done I think I like the idea that I'm trying to get stuff done so I always have stuff to do. Yeah, but I'm going to do a giveaway. And this is going to be, I think I'm able to do two. Since it's National Craft Month, you guys, maybe, just maybe, I can have a giveaway a weekend. And since I haven't done it the last, the first weekend, this weekend I'm going to do it. And I don't know if you all have these stamps. And I went to, um, what's the name of this? Joann's, yes. And I actually paid a dollar twenty-six cent, a dollar. I think they were one fifty-nine, and they had the additional twenty-five percent off. So I paid a dollar something for them. So they had enough for me. When I see deals like this, I'm like, yes. So I was able to get these stamps right here so I bought duplicates of them because that's these make the perfect giveaway so I am going to hmm what can I say yes I am going to do a giveaway and I'll do another one next weekend and I don't know when so let's call this a hidden giveaway and I'm going to do oh I know what I could do I'm going to do this and all you have to do is leave me a comment yes and the next one I'm going to do so you have to look for it you don't know which of my videos the last two videos that I did if you leave a comment on the last two videos which one would be the Julie Nutting doll stamp video 
and this one would be the little darlings rubber stamp video I'm going to do a giveaway using those two videos leave me a comment I'm gonna pick someone out of those comments I'm gonna pick two people because I'm gonna make another packet I'm gonna do another packet and I'm going to give away Maybe I could come up with the little packet for these two stamps right here because I have it. And I know something else I can give away. And it won't be a lot of them. See these right here? These are my... I should have ordered more of these. I think I'm going to go... Before I tell you guys where I got these from, I'm going to go online and order some more. And then I will tell you where I got them from, okay? I know, sad. These are... If you could see all the different size little crochet flower bits and as you can see I got loads of them I don't want to give you guys all of my because I use stuff like this all the time so I think I could take you know a handful oh and I have the little cute container I'm gonna show you guys this I think this will be a good way to give this away I know I'm going to actually put a packet together. See, I'm all over the place. And I'll have to come back and show you what your packet will be. I'll probably make something because I have to find... I, I think I told you all in my last video. I did the Julie Nutting Dolls, layered them and everything. But I don't know where my dolls are because I cleaned up. And see, if I take a handful of these, just like this, and put them in my little coffee thing, I can use these as... A. And I think these are so cute. They come in a container like this. They're little coffee cups, you guys. The coffee, the, this part of it looks just like a little Dixie cup and it's, it's uh, paper. And this, it has a little top on it. A little coffee cup and you have your little coffee cup. And I could either send it like this or decorate it and send it. I take it and I put a little coffee stir in there. And let me see if I have one that I decorated already. Hold on. Yeah, I was using this as a sample. And I just put, I was using these in my umbrellas and my fabby-tastic umbrellas. Yeah, and I'll put them in here. See, there's the little stir. And I'll fill them up with this. But right now, I am going to go order more. And then I'll come back and tell you guys. I'll put in the link where I got these from. And yeah, you can order your own if you like. But these are two bags of them. They come like 500 in a bag. And they come from China. But anyway, um, Matter of fact, let me just tell you because you will not be seeing this video until I upload it. I get these from I Am Roses and I get the cups from uh, I Am Roses and they come like $500 in a bag for $15. Yeah, I think something like that. And these are, but it's well worth it. I think it's well worth it because you are able to... Um, use them on your little any of your little projects. So yeah, I'm going to share these and I'll do two of them and I'm going to pick two winners. I'm going to make up two little packets, pick two winners and yeah, I think I'm going to decorate the little container. Maybe I'll find other stuff to put it in. But yeah, okay you guys, so watch my last two videos. Make sure you leave a comment. If I don't see a comment, you're not going to be a winner. Yes, yeah, so I'm going to take some more and put them in here. There you go. And I'm going to put another little packet together. I don't know that I have other stamps, but I know I have these two. And maybe I'll do some copies. Yeah, so. All right, you guys. Um, let me go ahead and get this done. I'll talk to you later. Happy, happy crafting. You guys have the whole month to craft. Craft because this month is what? National Craft Month. Yeah, so. Yeah, I'm going to go ahead and do that. And I'll come back and talk to you later. Thanks for watching, everyone. Bye-bye.